Okay, so in this third video, I'm going to be showing you how I created the little um, kitty cat pop-ups that roll over, uh, or that appear when you roll over the header banner here. Um, if you'll notice, uh, if you go from left to right, a kitty will pop on the left to the right, it's in the middle, all the way to the right, you know. Um, so, um, how did I do that? Well, you have to create, here let me show you. Um, I made a bunch of box layers and I changed the opacity to zero on every one of them. Okay, so I'm just going to bring them to light and make them visible here. So these are the, the, the invisible layers that I've created um, at 100% opacity. Um, and now, uh, I've named them Meow, the first one Meow, the second one Meow Meow, <laughs> the third one Three Meows, the fourth Four Meows, fifth and sixth, you know it goes on and on, five and six Meows. Um, uh, and and you, could, you could name them anything you like. Um, the reason I named them that is because when you roll over it, the name of the button appears. So I'm sure if you if you've been on the site you've seen that if you roll over the cat appears and then also the name of the button, which for this first box would be meow, and then you roll over this another cat appears and then there's meow meow and you roll over this and meow 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 you know, all the way to six. Um, so uh, it's important to know that that whatever whenever you're creating a, a button, that you should name it something significant because when people roll over it it's going to appear on the website. Um, okay, so so why did I do this? Why did I make these layers and then make them uh, completely transparent? Well, basically what I'm doing is um, creating the rollover area. So I want this whole area, uh, when people roll over this entire space, I want something to happen, okay? I want something to happen when they roll over this box here. I want another thing to happen when they roll over this second box and I want something else to happen when third box, fourth box, fifth box, sixth box, okay? Um, I could have just made this one box and had one thing happen when you roll over this entire area but I wanted a bunch of different kitties to pop up at different moments, not all at the same time, so yes, that is the wacky brain of Adam Charrington for you. Um, so you just, um, you know, you create layers, six of them that are this big, and then you just put them right next to each other. Okay, so hopefully you, you understand that. So why did I make them transparent? Well, you obviously don't want to leave that on your website. I mean, that would be an absolutely horrible website. If I ever came to something like that, I'd probably just bounce immediately, right? So you um, change it to zero. You don't want them to be visible. You're just wanting them to be um, the roller rollover areas. So there we go and in order to get the little cat to roll over like I did for this first one the meow button um, you would name it, it remember it has to be named exactly the same the layer has to be named exactly the same for, for the pop-up and the button to match up so if you have meow button which is this right here then you would have to have meow pop-up Okay, these, these this hyphen button and hyphen pop up are hints that Site Grinder uses too. Um, and as I said, I'm not going to go into too much detail about how to use those because they have a ton of videos on their website that show exactly how to do it. Um, but that's that's just how you do it with Site Grinder. So for this first box, it's named Meow hyphen button. So in order to get the cat to pop up, I do Meow hyphen pop up. And what happens when it, when you roll over? A little cat appears. So you can have anything occur when you roll over that. You can put, uh, uh, I don't know, what, you know, whatever. Get 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 creative. You can have fireworks go off or whatever. I don't know. Like if you were good at flash, you know, you can do all kinds of stuff. Um, it's just whenever somebody rolls over this in a transparent box, that cat will pop up. 
that's all this is for um, that's all I was trying to do with this and it is the same across all these others so we have meow meow button which is the second box the transparent box then you'll go down and find meow meow pop-up which is here meow meow pop-up and you click it and another cat appears so you hear one cat appears you're here that one the first cat disappears and then this one appears and the same with the third fourth fifth and sixth that's all it is it's um fairly straightforward if you have any questions about it then you can email me at adam at sitegrindermastery.com um, hopefully uh, this video is fairly clear um, clear enough anyway where you can understand how to do it so uh, I guess that's it for now uh, I'll see you in the fourth video and uh, we'll be talking about how I formatted the video player on um, the video web page alright bye